Namaskar. In this video, I will introduce the Indian classical instrument Sarod. Sarod is one of the popular instrument among the Indian classical instruments. Let's see the brief history of the Sarod. The word Sarod roughly translates to beautiful sound or melody in Persian language. Many scholars of Indian classical music believes that the Sarod is a combination of ancient Chitravina and the medieval Indian Rabab. The present day Sarod is believed to be some 300 years old. In popular history, the Sarod is believed to have descended from the Afghan Rabab, whereas the Rabab has a wooden fretboard and gut frets, but the Sarod has no frets and covered with a metal plate for the fingerboard. The conversion of the Sarod from Rabab to the present model is generally credited to Niyamutullah Khan of Lucknow and as well as Gulam Ali Khan of Gwalior. A similar Rabab style instrument is also found in South India, especially in the states of Karnataka, Kerala and Tamil Nadu, which is known as Swarabhat. However, this instrument is out of use in the present days. There are two distinguished types of Sarods we can find in the popular performance tradition. First one is designed by Alauddin Khan and his brother Ayat Ali Khan. This instrument has 25 strings in all. These include four main strings, four jod strings, two chikari strings and 15 tarab strings. The main strings are tuned to ma, sa, pa lower and sa lower. Presently, this sarod is known as Ali Akbar Khan style sarod and it is played by the musicians belonging to Maihar Gharana. Another version of the sarod is generally known as Amjad Ali Khan style sarod and it has six main pegs including four main strings for performance and two jod strings as well as two supportive drones called as chikaris. Now let us see what are the parts of the instrument. The sarod is made of a single wood. This is a single wood piece which has no neck. So this comes under zither category of the instruments. At the back side, this is a sound box and the front, it is covered with a large stretched goat skin and there is a bridge which is called as godi is fixed on the skin at the bottom the metal piece is known as langot in the front it is covered with a large metal piece this is the fingerboard which has no frets there is some space to hold our thumb and to play the instrument at the back in the upper side it has one extra sound box called as gubba and there is an ard made with a bone this is like the nut of the violin instrument and a small bridge again here which is also called as ghodi jodki ghodi the instrument has four pegs for the main strings and as well as four 
pegs for jod strings there are two chikari pegs and 15 for the sympathetic strings the sympathetic strings are placed below the main strings hence there are two layers of strings we can see over here sitting position and holding the instrument we need to sit in ardha padmasana the right leg is upside and usually we cover our legs from a shawl so that it is a respect to the audience as well as the musicians sitting in front of us and the instrument is kept on our right leg here hold properly with the right hand place the right hand and sarod is played with a triangular shaped coconut shell and it is to be hold this way like we hold the pen to write something or a little bit curved way which we hold like a guitar plucker as we know there are two types of sarods this particular model is known as ali akbar khan style or mahar sarod which has four main strings and four jod strings this instrument is tuned into c scale before getting started to play something on the sarod we will have a look on how to tune the instrument so these are the four main pegs related to four main strings we should select the second one from this side that is sa or shadja this is madhya saptaka shadja this should be tuned to c next is third peg which is set to third string from the down this should be tuned to mandra saptaka panchama and the last one which is mandra saptaka shadja after tuning this three strings get the first string that should be tuned into madhyama or ma of the mid octave now let's see how to tune the jod strings the first jod string should be tuned to ni of the lower octave the next one is for re of the mid octave next one is for ga of the mid octave and the next one is for sa is for the mid octave so this sounds ni re ga sa niregasa and these two chikaris are to be tuned at the higher sa or tara saptaka shadja to tune them we should pluck them near by the bridge one by one and there are different ways to tune the taraf strings the first is generally tuned to dha of uh, mandra saptaka or ni of the mandra saptaka dha here i have tuned it to dha the next one is the second layer of the taraf there are two layers so the next is on the second layer sa re and this is generally tuned to komal ga which is 1 2 3 4 which is the fourth peg and fifth peg shuddha ga sixth peg ma seventh peg tivra ma eighth peg pa ninth 
ध टेन्थ कोमल नी इलेवेन्थ शुद्ध नी ट्वेल्थ सा हायर ऑक्टेव सा थर्टींथ रे ऑफ द हायर ऑक्टेव फोर्टींथ ग ऑफ द हायर ऑक्टेव फिफ्टींथ इज प ऑफ द हायर ऑक्टेव एंड समटाइम दीज आर प्लेड दिस वे let us see the fundamental strokes there are basically two strokes one is out or downwards another is in or upwards the downward stroke is major stroke in sarod that is called as da and upward stroke called as ra or da so there are only two strokes which are known as bol within these two da and ra strokes we can generate several strokes like da dir da ra dir dir da ra da ra da ra da da dir 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 da ra da ra da and so on now let's see how to play the strokes find the second wire from the bottom the second string is mid octave sa first play the outward stroke on the second string and that is da second stroke is upwards that is ra practice da and ra alternatively da ra da ra da ra da ra now let us practice da and ra on all four main strings we will begin from the fourth string among the main strings one is downwards second third fourth fourth string is made of copper or brass play da and ra we need to play eight strokes minimum for the practice da ra da ra da ra da ra we can keep in mind two sets of four strokes like dara dara and dara dara let us see how to play them da ra da ra da ra da ra now play the same exercise on another string which is the third string from downside da ra da ra da ra da ra play the same exercise on the next string which is the second string from downside da ra da ra da ra da ra the same exercise on the first string that is also known as madhyama or main string da ra da ra da ra da ra so eight strokes or eight bowls on every string beginning from the fourth one 3 2 1 start mm -hmm. 